Kerry, what can you learn from games like this? You know, you don't have LeBron, you don't have JR, uh, Kevin Love. Just what did you take away from it? Um, we came out and gave a good start. Uh, you know, created separation into the third, but uh, we were in a good place. And then, uh, you know, they started making shots, started spreading the ball around, um, you know, a few transition layups. So, uh, I mean, the game was, uh, you know, we, we, we had it close enough. Um, and then they started creating separation. So uh, going forward, you just try to look at film, a few shots here and there that could have gone our way. Um, few dis- defensive position, uh, possessions, offensive rebounds. Um, you know, so you just try to learn as much as you can and move forward. Kyrie, what about your mindset changes when LeBron is not in the lineup? You know, my mindset doesn't change too much. I mean, I understand that uh, you know, there's a few extra shots I have to take, but I also have to create a lot more plays for my teammates. I try to do that tonight. Um, you know, start of the game, throughout the game. Uh, you know, understanding that. I'm going to need other guys to, to be in position to, to play at an even higher level, especially when we have a, a gap like Brian not playing. So, um, you know, you just take it as, as that um, and then, um, you know, try to put guys, put guys in a great position to succeed. So. You acknowledged uh, Darren Williams when he was on the bench when we were in Dallas. You know, I, I didn't know. Who did you say? You acknowledged Darren Williams when uh, he was on the bench when we were in Dallas. So, oh, okay. I didn't know, like, if there's anything to your guys' relationship, but what, what do you think his game could add to your guys' group? Uh, I mean, until he gets here, um, you know, get settled in, uh, you know, I'll probably have a better answer for you, Dave, but I mean, obviously we, we kind of know his body of work and what he can bring to a team. Um, it's just now you have to formulate it uh, into a dynamic that fits our team. So, uh, like I said, I'll have a better answer for you when, we, when, when he comes here um, and, you know, he gets settled in. He's a former five-time All-Star, and, and Corver is one of the best three-point shooters, um, you know, and, and Derek Williams as well. All three of them coming here. Um, what about you know the, the work that, that Griff has done to continue to build this roster uh, with those kinds of guys? I mean, I think you guys know I've, I've gone on record saying that uh, you know Griff has one of the hardest jobs, but he's he's unbelievable at it. Uh, he exudes a lot of confidence and. You know, not only the guys that he brings in, but um, the guys that are here. So uh, for us, just leave trust in the front office, and I think he does a great job. So, uh, you know, we have a, a great relationship, uh, very open in terms of communication, and um, I think he's doing great. You like that one? Muy bien, la tiene LeBron, y se va a ir hasta adentro. LeBron la clava, dos con fuerza. A la izquierda para Colbert, solito de tres, en camino, sí, señor. Deja la marca de Thompson, taponazo de Tristan Thompson. Haciendo uno contra uno contra Brines, Kyrie Irving, busca el crossover, qué lindo, de reversa, Kyrie Irving.